Ladies, I'm officially pissed off right now. The official actual cheer girls are driving all of us crazy as of right now and beyond. Recently, Lucas just lost hope to the actual cheer girls who always cause a lot of chaos including the entitlement of being an entitled Karen. Me too Penelope. We also have been hearing the dark true colors about the cheer girls. And we all hope everyone is feeling the same way as much as Lucas Salusky is losing hope to them as well. Penelope, we have been hearing about the four remaining cheer girls along with the seven other cheer girls. We and our evil clones will have to cut ties with them forever, and we all mean 100%. I mean, they all are the main reason why they had to brainwash our evilest clones, thinking that his evil versions of ourselves turned out evil. I agree with you Victoria and Penelope. Looks like we need to put an end on the actual cheer girls by hating them forever and staying away from them for good and forever. I know right ladies. That's why a lot of people will have the only option to hate them forever is because they are nothing but Karens and Mary Sues. These ladies need a big karma by us and we are going to call their parents via using Zoom and watching them get grounded for all of the history. I hope these nasty cheer girls will get arrested and will receive a permanent restraining order on each other as of right now. We, we all agree, agree with, with you. you. Ariana, Victoria, Cecile and Penelope, also known as the actual cheer girls. Are the four of you out of your minds right now? We all can't believe you got the nerve of doing a lot of bad stuff like becoming entitled Karens and Mary Sue's like a big baby. Victoria is right. Not to mention that the four of you also went on a crime spree and killed over a lot of victims and people. Do the four of you ladies realize that a lot of people have been scarred because of what the four of you did? Do the four of you realize what happened to all of us when the four of you ladies got the nerve to brainwash all the people and doing a lot of bad acts of crimes while going on a crime spree? Do the four of you realize that the four of you and seven other chair girls are no longer friends for what the crap the four of you have done? You know what? Victoria, since you called Molly a freaking football head too many times, and since you and the rest of the cheer girls went out on a fucking crime spree and become an entitled people like Ken and Karen always have all the time, you and the cheer girls have crossed the goddamn red line this time. Now, what do the four of you have to say for yourselves before we are no longer friends anymore? Listen, we're sorry. We couldn't control our fears and emotions. All we wanted to do is to hang out with our boyfriends and to go out on adventures. Can the eight of you please give us another chance? We promise that we will be better and good this time. Absolutely, not. All of your apologies have been denied, permanently, 100%. Never in my life see all four of you and the seven other cheer girls do something sick like this. Ferocious acts, you ladies are so sick in the head. We're going to cut ties to the four of you and the seven other cheer girls permanently. So this will mean that we cheer girls are no longer friends anymore. And because of it, all of you and the rest of the cheer girls are busted big time and banned from seeing each other. Go home right now while we all get off the phone from your parents when we all tell them about this. Wow. <coughs> 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 Man, when will these actual cheer girls ever learn not to do horrible stuff? Can't they just straighten up themselves? I know right, Penelope. Besides, they're just rip-offs to all good cheer girls like us and evil cheer girls like our evil clones. We all just lost hope to them for the very first time, just like the good users and everyone did to them. Oh 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 Penelope you freaking psychopath we can't believe you done a lot of horrible stuff and then go out on a crime spree along with Ariana, 
Victoria and Cecile. Not to mention that you brainwashed Lucas Olusky's versions of the Cheer Girls and the Evil Cheer Girls and killed over a dozen of people. That is so it missy. We are calling the police to arrest you. But mum and dad, I'm really sorry for all of this. Apology unaccepted permanently. Maybe you shouldn't go on a crime spree and make victims be traumatized for life. You are a big disgrace to the family, like big time. Go to your room, wait for the police to arrest you and think about how many victims you have traumatized. See, I told you that Penelope Taylor was acting like a motor car in between. Victoria, how dare you do a lot of horrible stuff and go on a crime spree along with Penelope, Cecilia and Ariana. Not to mention that you also made victims be traumatized for life. That is so it right now. You are grounded for the rest of your pathetic life. Go to your room and think about how many victims you have traumatized. Take that you ugly woman here. That's what you get for calling Molly a football head, which the object head term is getting overused and annoying right now to all of us and beyond. We love you very much, Molly. Cecilia so spoiled brat. Why would you get the nerve to do a lot of horrible stuff and cause a mischief by going on a crime spree and get victims traumatized for life? And we also can't believe you assaulted victims to death. Are you some kind of predator? That is a serious crime. Not to mention that you and your friends killed a lot of people and go out on a crime spree. What's even worse, Cecile, is that you doused a lot of sheep and goats with gasoline and burned them up on fire. Have you lost your god and mind about sheep and goats? Don't even tell because you have. That is so it. We are calling the police right now to arrest you because you went on a crime spree. Now go to your room and wait for the police to arrest you and think about how many victims you have traumatized. That's what you get for becoming a rich girl like this Cecile the Spoiled Brat. Victory belongs to all of us and to everyone. It's game over for you. Ariana, are you sick in the fucking head? We can't believe you actually went on a crime spree and caused a lot of victims to be killed. Not to mention that you also did a lot of horrible stuff as well. That is so it right now. You are grounded for all of the history and you will get a permanent restraining order along with Cecil, Penelope and Victoria. Go to your room right now and think about how many victims you have traumatized. Take that you spoiled brat. That's what you absolutely get for becoming a spoiled psychopath. Yes. Take that you spoiled actual cheer girls. That is what the four of you get for doing a lot of bad stuff.